In the dimly lit woods of Blackwood Hollow, a sense of foreboding hung heavy in the air. Shadows danced among the trees, and whispers of ancient secrets echoed through the dense underbrush. It was a place where the line between reality and myth blurred, where legends came to life under the glow of the full moon. Deep within the heart of the forest, nestled amidst the gnarled roots of an ancient oak, lived a creature of nightmares, a werewolf known only as Fenrir. His existence was a curse, his nights spent prowling the woods in search of prey to sate his insatiable hunger. Fenrir was no ordinary werewolf. His transformation was not bound by the lunar cycle, but by the darkness within his own soul. When night fell, his human form twisted and contorted, giving way to a monstrous beast fueled by primal instinct. One fateful evening, as the moon hung low in the sky, a group of unsuspecting travelers ventured into Blackwood Hollow. Ignorant of the danger lurking in the shadows, they set up camp beneath the boughs of the ancient trees, unaware of the eyes that watched them from the darkness. As the fire crackled and laughter filled the air, Fenrir's senses sharpened. He could smell their fear, taste their anticipation. With a primal growl, he emerged from the depths of the forest, his claws glinting in the moonlight. The traveler's joy turned to terror as they beheld the monstrous form of Fenrir. With lightning speed, he pounced upon them, his fangs dripping with saliva as he tore through flesh and bone. Screams pierced the night, echoing through the hollow as the forest bore witness to the carnage. By the time dawn broke, only silence remained in Blackwood Hollow. The travelers were gone, their campsite nothing more than a memory swallowed by the ever-hungry woods. And Fenrir, the cursed creature of legend, retreated once more into the shadows, his hunger temporarily sated, but his thirst for blood unquenchable. For in the heart of Blackwood Hollow, the legend of the werewolf lived on, a chilling reminder of the darkness that lurks within us all.